All right, Brian, now if we're going to get you ready to compete in that dog show, we've got a lot of training to cover. Let's begin by doing some work with the clicker. Oh, yeah, I've seen these. You click it when you want me to do a trick, and then I get a treat, so I associate the two. No, I use it to punctuate my jokes. Now, Brian, you've got to roll over and be good on all fours. If Nathan Lane can do it, so can you. Okay. <laughs> but maybe we should just focus on getting ready for the show. Well, look who wants to be prepared. You're a regular Beagle Scout. Wait, shouldn't I be the one who clicks if I like the joke? You can't just click after everything you say. If it's funny, I can. And so far, they've all landed. Unlike the planes on 9-11. See? No click. That one was in poor taste. Not funny. You know, I was supposed to be on one of those planes. Yeah, me too. How you doing? You feeling good? Because this thing is going to come down to the arbitrary whims of whatever elderly volunteers were able to get transportation here on a Tuesday. Yeah, I... Hey, watch it! The hell's his problem? Careful. That's your competition. His name's Max. He's a four-time winner and kind of a crowd favorite. Okay, who wants to start the dog show? Who wants to start it? Yes, you all want to start the dog show, don't you? Don't you? Don't you? Don't you? Don't you? Don't you? That'll do it for the males. And as our judges tabulate the results, we can now announce our female division. The winning bitch for the 10th year in a row is Katherine Heigl. Thank you, thank you. No, but for real, it's that dog, Ellie, over there. And our winner in the male division is Brian Griffin. Yes! Man, thank you for all your help, Stewie. I really couldn't have done it. What the? What's going on? This... this is it? It's happening right here? Right now? Uh-huh. They have to certify the union, Brian. Stud is ready to mount. Please turn up the lights. What? No! No, the opposite! In fact, could someone maybe turn on some... some Drake or The Weeknd? Ha! <laughs> He's blowing it! He can't do it! Quagmire? What are you doing here? Oh, I have an all-access pass to anything in this town that's sex-related. Offering manual assistance. Commencing union. Okay, okay, thanks, man, but, uh, you know, I, I got this, I got this. If you just, just give me a second to get, like, a scenario in my head. Uh, maybe a hot babysitter who needs to pay for college, so she... Uh, can somebody please shut those dogs up? This specimen is unable to perform. Please bring in the boxer. I'm sorry, Brian, but this is what I was trying to tell you. I'm sorry, too, but I see now that you were right. I'm just not sure how this could work or, or how our relationship could fit into your world. Hey, let's talk. I guess this is goodbye. I guess it is. I'll always remember you, Brian. And I'll always remember you, Ellie. I promise to name one of the puppies after you. Let's just cross our fingers. It's not one of the ones he eats. Thanks. That means a lot. Okay. Or the part where he bites down on the back of my neck, so we should probably wrap this up. Yep. Whoa, Max's grandfather may have been a horse. Come on, let's just go home. Okay. Is this the romantic ending you were hoping for? Look, that was a tricky situation. All right, the lights, the people watching. If, if it hadn't been for all that, I, trust me, I, I would have I set her world on fire. No way, you didn't even start the fire. Oh, no. Nancy Reagan, preschool Chris, Nosy Valley, young Lois, German guy, lots of dogs, Arthur Valentine. We didn't write an ending, so we're all together trying to make it better. They didn't write an ending, but what the heck, I still take the check, the check, the check. Mom killed a jaywalker.